everyone, how's it going? Travis here from The Wolf Hunters. And Susie Q. We have a reaction video for you. Social media platforms are above. Links down in the description box below. The next video is brought to you by Richard. Richard, Richard go ahead. Uh, Richard is bringing us. Are y'all ready for this? Sleepy Time Gorilla Museum with... The donkey-headed adversary of humanity opens the discussion, which I have to say is a pretty captivating title. I don't, I don't know what to expect. So we're going to get into this, right? We are. But before we do, y'all, head on over, hit the like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and comment below. Okay. Wow, I love so, this. The best way to explain how I feel is I'm intrigued. Like, this is intriguing. Like, right off the bat. I mean, within the first few seconds, I was like, whoa, this is interesting. This is different. And I really enjoy it. It's very unique, uh, very creative, very talented. Yeah, I also like how, like, that drummer is standing. I think there's two drummers, but one of them is standing, which I think is cool. Um, these guys are really entertaining. Yes. I, like this would be a, a cool show to watch. Um, they are as captivating as their title, and I, I'm looking forward to the rest. You know, I've never heard anything like this before in my life. And that's like, what's so fascinating is somebody was the first to think of it, you know, at least from what my uh, acknowledgement, I don't, I'm, maybe there's something else like that out there somewhere. I personally have never heard anything like this. I really love Remarkable. the bass line. I really love just how playful it is. And I've never seen, at least in real life, 
violins being played this way. Yeah, like I have her. I actually never really cor- correlated that like horror sound that they played in the beginning on the violin with the violin. Like when when I saw them playing the violin, I was like, oh, like that's the instrument they use to make that noise. You know, like. Arr, arr, or whatever but I've never seen it and then just the whole entire song so far the way they've been playing the violin has been absolutely incredible that you get when you play like a record backwards like it has that like feel to it um um as they're like playing it and singing and they've somehow managed to do these things that seem like counterintuitive but it sounds totally on purpose like it is on purpose and i just i'm fascinated by that like i I, like i'm like my jaw is dropped because i'm just like who is behind this this is this is this is Fascinating. Yeah, Richard, this this was an excellent request. I, I this is awesome. Take us into the ground. Eaters of the air, drive us from the sky. Eaters of the green, take us into the sea. Eaters of the scraps, take us in our beds. Oh my gosh, so fascinating. Uh, this is this is something I truly love. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, this Wait, is something I truly love about reacting, is that we get to see these, these bands that I know, like I know that I don't know that I would ever have stumbled upon Sleepy Time Girl Museum. And I get to because of Richard. Like I think that that is just such a privilege of doing this. Um, 
wow, that is so cool. I just yeah. thought it was cool that they're like all moving in the same tempo, but they were like using the time different, all doing like different things. Like you have to be an incredible musician to play your part while everybody else is playing something seemingly at, you know, at different times. Like that is just, yeah. that shows that they are incredible musicians. And I, I, I appreciate that. Yeah. Thank you so much for that. Thank you guys for hanging out. If you enjoyed hanging out, hit subscribe. Stay tuned. Stay positive. We love you guys. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. I just want to bang my bed.